Listen, I don't want to upset your rhythm, Cal, but the boss wants a word. It'll be good for us. Here he is, Chief. An error has been detected on line 10A. All our clamps are jammed. I need two workers to climb up and secure the cables. That's not an easy maneuver. The gal will double your pay for this shift. Why, Cal? What's her score? That couldn't hurt. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Get to work. This way. I'm right behind you. Now you look at that. A separatist ship. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. All right. Let's go. Come take a look at this. It's a Jedi fighter. What a score! It's a real scrapper's payday. I mean, this thing's been here, what, four years? Five. <laughs> Never flew this, went down on a blaze of glory. Those Jedi. A real tragedy. I've always said they couldn't all be traitors. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I guess it's just our lucky day. Empire's gonna get a lot of good material out of it. Yeah, here we are, scrapping these ships from the war, just so they can turn around and make new ones. What a racket, huh? All of us risking our necks for the bosses. And the pay was better back during the Republic, too. Hey, you really should watch what you say. Listen to me. Find us free like this? Could be a ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you're a young guy. You don't end up like me. <sighs> Eventually. You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Whatever you say. Hey, we should get back down. You're not listening to me. What is that? You saw, okay? Please no, trust me. I've seen them. I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. The bounties out on people I like know. you. I know. Yeah, we're ready. We need to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. You holding up okay? Good. You? Yeah. Kel. I've been working with you some time now. I've 
I've never seen you do anything like that before. <laughs> We've been through some hell together. <laughs> so, I know the risk that you took for me. I just, I don't know how to repay you. Don't mention it. I mean it. Oh, you don't have to worry about me. But this place, it's not safe. Tapper's owes me a favor. Oh. I heard he was up on uh, La Shadella. Yeah. He won't be seeing me for a while, Prof. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, Cal. Is this all of them? Yes, second sister. We seek a dangerous fugitive. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. Turn yourself in. Or everyone present shall face summary execution. I think it's time someone came forward. I, uh, I've been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. We refit and rebuilt ships. Best in the galaxy. Then came the Empire. <clears throat> and engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. Prof. We all know the truth. We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire. We're all just expendable. Yes, you are. No! Look at this. A lightsaber. I found the 
the Jedi! What's that? Checking out the disturbance. Oh, that hurts. Hold it. Don't move. How'd you get here? Easy now. Got a stowaway. Jedi! Jump now! Hold on! Somewhere. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who was your master, Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? thing off and grab some seat. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Seer Junda, and this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the man is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal, Kestis. Who was that back there? Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? And what's the bounty on Jedi these days anyway? That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You too? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council? Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. This is 
Vagana. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? Will you hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron, containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Batoli Reef fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Breeze. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. Contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. 
Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death Mirror Zepho, it's your choice. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Bubbles ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Of course it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> landed. Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. My friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. The distinctive striations. It can only be a Rosha tree from Kashyyyk. It's time to call on an old friend. If the Zepho had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarfel will know about it. It's work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely use the Force. An advanced civilization of force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zeppo journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk? I, look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. So we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings, but they caught me and they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. No. Yeah. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No.
But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. Oh, tell me we're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I've rigged the Mantis' transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah? Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No sweat. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. Right. All right. All right. I don't see anything. You're preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. Doesn't look good. The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Mookies have been enslaved or displaced. Oh, that was a close one, kid. Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Guerrilla fighters, Wookiees and off-worlders ambushing an Imperial convoy. Walker's approaching their position. Tarful could be with him. Tarful could be anywhere, like deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options, and, and they'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We use the scrap walkers on Bracca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in the Clone Wars. Captain, <laughs> get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen. Those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. I've no freeze grease to work his magic. Hey, do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. Right if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. You ready for a swim, BD? <laughs> It actually worked. Okay, uh, throttle. Report, what's happening over there? You're in violation of Imperial Protocol. Can you shut that guy up? Stand down or we won't have... Better. <laughs> Let's do this. Hold on! Brace yourself, BD! Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? No, we are not doing that again. <laughs> you just wrecked a perfectly good walker. Got a name? Cal Kestis. Saw Guerrero. What are you doing on Kashyyyk? Looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt and pill supply lines. Hey! So, who are you looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Tarful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. Striking at the Empire from the Shadowlands. Huh. Seer, Grease, this is Saul. How you doing? What do you want with Tarful? 
Jedi business. The Jedi are dead. Not all of them. <clears throat> you get that awful corpse? My master gave it to me. This pad supports an Imperial refinery that runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captives there are guerrilla fighters. I should help them. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Oh, wait a minute, hold on, wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but it is not built for close support. We'll stay here and monitor Imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. Join us when you're ready. Go, go! Imperial sap refinery lies dead ahead. What does the Empire want with tree sap? Nothing good. They refine the sap into a powerful compound, and they're rushing to expand production. We have to stop them. That's the plan. We don't know their end game, but they spread themselves too thin. This map we've recovered proves it. Here you go, bud. These refineries double as brutal prison camps. We use those cutters to create a distraction while you take your lightsaber and free the Wookiees inside. We need their help to stop the Empire. Understood. Watch yourself in there. You hear that? Say he needs my help. Come on, buddy. Comrades, friends, family, to the Empire. Dark times. And yet the fire still burns. Hope still burns. The Jedi are not yet lost. We are not yet lost. Kashyyyk yeah. is not yeah. yet lost yeah. for the cause! Yeah. You've seen what the Empire has done to Kashyyyk. These stories are playing out all over the galaxy. My partisans could use a Jedi on our side. I'm honored. We have our own mission I can't walk away from. Not yet. The offer stands. Keep it in mind. How predictable. Oh, yes. I know your name. Your past. And most importantly, about Cordova. Tell me, where did he hide the holocron? Outstanding. Not quite as gifted as Sears' last apprentice, but not bad. 
didn't even keep in count. I'm surprised she didn't tell you. Sarah was never good at keeping secrets. And you know her so well, huh? Mm. <laughs> she was weak. Cracked in an Imperial torture chair. Surrendered the location of her naive Padawan. They would never have found me. If it wasn't for her, she betrayed me. You're a Trilla. In the flesh. I won't let you manipulate me. So sure are you? When faced with a choice to protect herself or her Padawan, she chose self-interest. She'll sell you out, too. Well, I can handle myself. <laughs> Can you afford to take that chance? Your new master harbors great darkness. The look on her face when she saw what they had done to me, as I am now. She turned, exposing her true nature. She used the dark side. She cut herself off from the Force. Oh? How long before she cracks and betrays you too? Is that who you want beside you when you find the Holocron? What would Jaro Tapal say? You have no right to mention his name. I wonder, what would he think if he could see his Padawan now, skulking in the shadows with a betrayer, granting her access to a legion of impressionable students? No. I won't let anyone touch them. I thought the same thing once. Get to the Jedi! Padawan, where is the Force? Everywhere. It is within me. It surrounds me. Just so. It connects you. There will be times when emotion, pain, or exhaustion trick you. You will feel cut off, isolated. This is an illusion. Your lightsaber lies there, out of reach, but you remain connected through the Force. Feel that energy around you and summon your weapon. The Force is with me. It connects us. Yeah, I think so. Here it is. I have finally found an intact representation of this sacred Zepho artifact. My friend, look closely. This is Mictrol at the Vault Ambergano. You can see an object in their hand. Based on this imagery, I believe this object allows a Force wielder to perceive the mysteries of the Vault. This is the key and the guide. The Zepho Astrium. But who would destroy images of it, and why? It requires more research. However, our next step is clear. Find an astrium, if any still exist. An astrium? You ever heard of it? Me neither. But a key. Yeah, I understand that. Looks like we know what we have to find. You're famous down there. Yeah, they're in... Ugly group, huh? They smell like used droid oil. <laughs> At least you're okay. Yeah, a complication we could have avoided. Luckily, we found you. We have another complication. The Empire knows about the Holocron. That's not good. The entire mission is now at risk. And I had a nice chat with the second sister. Trilla. What did she tell you? She told me... She told me you betrayed her to the Empire. Is it true? She'll say anything to jeopardize this mission. Is it true? She was my apprentice. Before the purge. You should have told me. We're getting an encrypted message from Kashyyyk.
Mari. Cal, we found Tarful, and he is willing to meet you. But that's not all. The Empire overran our position at the refinery. Saw retreated off-world. Some of us have joined the Wookiee fighters in the forests. Be careful. You too. Later. Later. We have our lead. Okay, this is fine. Everything is gonna be fine. Glad you made it. This is Chieftain Tarful. I'm on a mission from Master Eno Cordova. He was looking for a Zepho artifact. Finding it could help save the Jedi. Cordova found wisdom at the top of the origin tree. You should seek answers there. It's massive. I don't even know where to start. Well, you might be able to find a way up through its root system, but most of it's underwater. You'll need this breather. Thank you. What will you all do now? The only thing we can, keep fighting. Good luck. Hope we meet again. <laughs> What's this? A Bracca scrap rat playing Jedi. I told the Grand Inquisitor you wouldn't be stupid enough to show your face here again. Especially after we wiped out that feeble resistance. <sighs> Love it when I'm wrong. Here to hurt you. We're friends, understand? Friends. It's okay. It's a piece of the Night Sister's ship. We need to remove it. This is gonna hurt, okay? I'm sorry. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> least we could do. You're giving us a lift? There's still so much the Empire hasn't touched. Very nice. Let's look.
last, I found my quarry. The Astrium. Used by the Zepho sages millennia ago. I hold in my hand a piece of galactic history. Oh, I will never be able to thank Tarful enough. Do you know what this means, my friend? No need to return to Darthamir. Darkness clouded every attempt at finding the Astrium inside Kujit's tomb, but the Force... The Force has provided a new path. Kujit's huh. tomb. You're done hurting this world. I don't know what's got second sister thinking you're so important. She likes her souvenirs, but I'm not in it for the memories. And honestly, you're not worth my time. So let's make this quick. When you've already lost yourself, a limb's easy. You know, I was a Jedi. It'd be fun to bring you in. Watch you just like the rest of us! Oh, angers you. Just wait till the isolation, torture, mutilation, and your breath! I won't let you touch them! You can't stop the Empire! I can stop you. Down an Inquisitor. Hey! I thought you were dead. Glad you're okay. We should get back. Seer and Grease are expecting us. Cordova believed the key to the vault is on Dathomir. You find your Wookiee? Yep. But things are bad down there. Empires everywhere. Inquisitors? Altrilla. The second sister is gone for now, but she's still chasing us. I defeated the ninth sister. when I was captured by the Empire. I resisted. I swore to myself that I would die before I would talk. But then this dark shadow came. And he was worse than any nightmare I could have imagined. And I still fought. But in the end, I came apart. And I gave them Trilla. And I know there's nothing I can do to make that right. But, Cal, there's still a chance we can save the others on the holocron. Okay, look. The Ninth Sister said something about becoming an Inquisitor, like... like it's inevitable. But you went through the same thing she did, and you didn't join them. Cal... It's okay, Seer. We'll find Cordova's holocron. Hey! Get your lasers off my lunch! Doors, I got walls, I got Jedi, I'm fine. Yeah. Cal, do you have a moment? You've come a long way since Bracca, but the path is far from over. I want you to know the difficult challenges ahead. I can handle it. I know what you can do. I'm not denying that. And I know what has to be done. I've done it before. Cal, even the strongest of Jedi. I'm not Trilla. I'll be fine. I know you're not. I didn't say that. I'm not asking you to say anything. It's okay, Seer. Really. Just be safe, Cal. That's all. 
Hold it. Looks like the Zeppo were here. Strange. This place seems abandoned, but... You trespass, Jedi. You must be a Knight Sister. I had heard you were all dead. Not all. Dothamir is forbidden to you. Leave at once. Well, I'm afraid I can't do that, but perhaps we could help each other. You see, I... Easy. I'm not your enemy. Your actions say otherwise. Wait, hold on. I'm not here to... You will go no further. Stand aside. No. He was right about you. Who? What? Jedi are thieves and selfish liars who bring nothing but death. Back off. If you attack me again, I'll strike you down. Oh, I won't do a thing. But my murdered sisters. They will have their revenge. Master DePaul? Battle one, it's time for instruction. Yes, Master? Reach our position. Do not keep me waiting. We will begin with physical preparation. First, though, we have orders. Braca is secure. We move out from Maigito shortly. Yes! You must... <laughs> Master? Are you okay? Something is... No! No! What's happening? Why did the commander just... Bad one. Something terrible is happening. The clones have betrayed us. There are no answers to your questions. Not yet. We need to get off this ship. Quickly. Get to the escape pods. Use the maintenance halls. We trained for this. Do you remember? Yes, Master. Well, what about you? I will create a distraction and meet you. If I am not there when you arrive, depart without me. I will find you on Braca. Do you understand? Yes, Master. They're coming. I will seal the blast doors, but if any cross your path, do not hesitate. Go. And may the Force be with you. Go! Go! We'll just wait here until he's surrounded. What's that sound? Get ready! Move, Padawan. We have to leave now. The door controls!
Padawan. It is time for instruction. Yes. My blood is on your hands, apprentice. You are a failure, a weakling, a traitor. You are no Jedi! No! He's not got his plan. I can't say I didn't warn you. Leave me alone. Leave you? Alone? Lost? And defenseless in this dangerous place? Never. Okay, enough of this. Who are you really? Taran Malakos. A former Jedi. Like yourself. We have much in common. I doubt that. Oh? We both survived the purge. My troops betrayed me. I was forced to strike them down, and I escaped to this desolate place. To the darkness here. It almost took me. But I conquered it. You're the one the Knight Brothers follow. <laughs> yes. Well, these savages only respect strength. And as we both know, the Force is a most powerful ally. Oh. No, you use the Force to seize power. That's. That's everything the Jedi stood against. These are dark times! They will consume us if we do not stand with each other. I don't need your help. That broken lightsaber tells a different tale. You saw something in there, didn't you? Something terrible. There are many such places here in Dathomir. Join my family. And I can teach you how to control its power. Join my family. And I will teach you to control the power. Familiar words, Malikos. Sister Merin, you overstep your bounds. For years. You said the Jedi orchestrated the massacre that killed my sisters. Yet here one stands, and you seek only to bring him into your family. You were told to deal with it. Clearly you lack the power, little witch! Power? You are mad, Marikos. Dothamir has unmade you, and my misplaced loyalty has allowed you to lead the Knight Brothers astray. Unlike the Jedi, the Night Sisters of Dothamir do not turn on their kind. Our bond is eternal. Your sisters are dead! Yes. Their graves are all around you. Time to go. Foolish girl! This power is beyond your control! You both shall learn. When you face one night sister of Dothamir, you face us all! Run. Get us out of here! What'd you do, kid? I got dead witches crawling all over my ship! Just go!
What happened? Did you find the tomb? Your master's lightsaber. I saw him. Master Paul. I, I saw the day he died. I saw what I did. Cal. Now it's destroyed. I couldn't save him. Cal, you were only a child. No. No, I know I could have helped him if I'd been stronger and braver, if I would have listened to him. I could have helped him. I know it. Cal, it's time I told you everything that happened to me when I escaped the Empire. They brought Trilla in the room. And when I saw her eyes, they showed me what I had caused. She was an inquisitor. And something in me gave. And I lost all control. And I tapped into the dark side. And I killed them all. Every last one of them. Except for her. And for years, I couldn't forgive myself. I was a wreck. Because I had all this rage. And I tried pushing it down, but there was no hiding from myself. And all I wanted to do was die. But then I learned about the Holocron. A spark of hope that there could be a future. That we could move on. Get up. I can't change what I did no more than you can change what happened to your master. It's in the past, but Cal, you have to make a choice to move on. How? You're gonna start with this. You are going to build a new one. You will be tested. Yeah. But I'm ready. I don't mean just here. Every Jedi faces the dark side. And it's very easy to fail. You're still struggling with the dark side. Even after cutting yourself off from the Force. We will always struggle. But that is the test. It's the choice to keep fighting that makes us who we are. I guess it's about time I find out who I am. BD, don't come any closer. BD! Ah!
Failure is not the end, my friend. Time's come. This may be the last you see of me. I can sense the doom of the Jedi Order is upon us. <laughs> no! Failure is not the end. It is a necessary part of the path. Hope will always survive in those who continue to fight. Like you, BD-1. I believe you will find someone just as brave and persistent as you have been. And you will help them as you have helped me. But your memory will be completely lost. Are you sure you want to do this? Beginning total memory encryption. Only with a trusted connection will your memories be restored. I believe in you, as I always have. And I believe in whom you choose to replace me.
we did. I wouldn't be here without all of you. I used to sit on Baraka dreaming about storming Coruscant with survivors from the Jedi Council. Instead, the Order's hopes rest on a gambler, a fallen Jedi, and a failed Padawan. A bunch of screw-ups. You can say that again. But he's the only reliable one. He let Cordova wipe his memory so he could stay behind and guide us. But you're both willing to sacrifice everything. To keep going even when it seems impossible. Failure's a part of the journey. I get that now. Thank you. All of you. Lightsaber proves you were Jedi. No. Facing you. Memories that have haunted me since Braca. I won't run from them anymore. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. <laughs> What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say, Cal. Malikos said many things too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire, I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this... descended upon us... and cut down my people... my sisters... until I was left alone. With the dead. Then Malikos came and promised me revenge if I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. How Kestis? Malikos. Welcome home. Here to begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much to risk death? I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding, power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the Order. Restore the Jedi Order? Oh, you poor fool. 
It's over! Jedi fell long before the Purge. It was stifled by tradition. Deafened by our past glories. Blinded by endless war. Maybe. But it's never over, Malakos. We stand here now, with the chance to learn. To rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. And Dathomir will be your grave. <laughs> Let him lie in the dark with his secrets until death takes him. Why'd you help me? To rid Dothamir of that parasite. What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium. It opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it too. What empire? The empire. The one bent on exterminating force sensitive so no one can stand against it? Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. Thank you for helping me with Malikos. Thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. Right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah, I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. You finally found it. Yeah. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you. And your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. After the purge, I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding, I was, I was scared that they'd find out who I was or, or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listened? Well, no, but... Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. And now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night Sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but... Survivors. We adapt. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. 
What do you think, BD? I agree. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. And we trust you. You will have to earn it. Okay, fine. Grab some seat. Don't you try anything funny. Welcome aboard. They like you. You think it'll work? It worked for Cordova. You can make it work. She's right. Oh, hey, is anybody hungry? I, I was thinking of whipping up some scat steaks. I'm sorry, am I interrupting? No, Captain. And we couldn't have gotten this far without you. Oh, <laughs> well, uh, it's true, Grease. Thank you. Hey, I hope you get in there and you find that hollow thing. Holocron. Are you sure it's something you should find? What do you mean? The children on that list. If you take them from their homes to train as Jedi, won't they be hunted like you? It has to be kept out of the hands of the Empire. It'll help us put an end to the Empire. Oh, hey, uh, change of plans, we're arriving. Oh, Grease. Yeah? I take my steak rare. Huh. Huh? Okay, now we're cooking. Feeling I'd see you here. Oh? How uncharacteristically prescient of you. Here I thought your greatest virtue was your dogged persistence as you stumbled from one debacle to the next. Guess you made a mistake not killing me on Brocket then. A scant mercy. I waged one meaningless Padawan against a prize that will win me the Emperor's favor. You think I'm gonna let you walk away with the Holocron? Of course not. We both have our pride. But yours has cost you the lives of all the Force-sensitive children on that list, as well as your own. Like you said, Trilla, I'm persistent. that thing. It's been through hell. Don't go. We need to stick together. No. I'm going to lure them away, and then I'm going to circle back. Stay with the younglings, Trilla. May the Force be with you. Master! Don't leave us! Trilla, what's going to happen? It's okay. It's okay.
here. I saw what happened between you and Trilla, what you both went through. I'm so sorry. I was arrogant, I was foolish. I could never understand what you went through. She has a holocron. I don't know where she's taking it. I'm responsible for the path that Trilla is on. And what she does next is the cost of all of my mistakes. Our mistakes are in the past. And it's all of our responsibility, and it's about what we do next that's important. You taught me that, Seer. You're right. I know where she's taking it. There's a fortress where they take Jedi, where the Inquisitors come from. It's a place of torture. It's the place I escaped. I just never thought I'd be going back there. You won't be going alone. You'll have a friend with you. No. I'll have a Jedi with me. Neil. By the right of the Council, by the will of the Force, Cal Kestis. Rise, Jedi Knight. You are ready. So are you. This isn't good. With the defenses I got, our usual tricks just aren't gonna cut it. I can help. What are you thinking? A ritual. It will hide the ship, I hope. A ritual? She has a knack for this kind of stuff. What, hold, wait, wait a minute, now hold on now. What is this gonna require? A sacrifice. One of your arms will do nicely. Wait, what? Don't be so serious. Join me up front. Mother, lend me your strength. Sisters, mother, lend me your strength. Whatever she's doing, it's working. What do you think the odds are? My money's on you, kid. Let's go, buddy. Once we're inside, I'll engage their defense level, and then sabotage their sensors so the Mantis can extract us. You find the Holocron. Shall we stick together? I feel the pull. The lives of every child on that list are at stake. Whatever happens in there and whatever you see, don't worry about me, just... Get it and get out. Close it on the fortress. It's time.
I'm opening the path to the Holocron. Get to the Holocron. I'll divert reinforcements and join you as soon as I can. <laughs> Is ever truly over. This fight is over. I know the darkness that is eating you up inside, and every day we choose to either feed it or fight it. It's too late, sir. No, it's not. I know the choices that I made took all your choices away, and I have failed you, Trilla. I failed you. And I am so very sorry. I've carried so much hate for you. We shall see. an excellent inquisitor she's stronger than that no no yes strong with the dark side see her i can feel it inside of her see her see her hey listen to me you still have a choice
Hey. Hey, kid. Cal. Cal! See her. She's all right. She's all right. <laughs> yeah, you too. You did it. We did. Careful. Where are they? Well, they're out there. Whoa, hold on. Wait a minute. Sorry. That was you in the water, wasn't it? I'm glad you're okay. This one wouldn't leave your side. Thank you. Now what? Well, Captain, this is the end of my charter. Your contract has been fulfilled. Thank you, Grease. Well, if it's all the same to you, I was thinking that maybe I would stick around here and take you wherever you gotta go. Besides, the kid kinda looks up to me. What about that? We use it. To rebuild the Jedi Order. The next generation of Jedi. The Empire will be after them. Just like they're after us. The lives of every child on that list will be forever changed. Not by us. Their destiny should be trusted to the Force. So where to now? <laughs>